The stitches for rounds four to six are the same. In rounds four to six, work eighteen single crochets for each round. We'll demonstrate round four. Remove the marker. In round four, work one single crochet in each stitch. Finish a total of eighteen single crochets. Let's start. Round four is done. Please finish rounds five to six by yourself. Work eighteen single crochets for each round. Round six is done. In round seven, work set of two single crochets, one decrease, two single crochets for three times. Let's start. The first set. Work two single crochets. Mark the first stitch. Next, work one decrease. Decrease is to combine two stitches into one stitch. Then work two single crochets. Once that is done. The second set, work two single crochets. Next, work one decrease to combine two stitches into one stitch. Then work two single crochets. The second set is done. The third set, work two single crochets. Next, work one decrease. Then work two single crochets.
Round seven is done. In round eight, work set of once and crochet one decrease for five times. The first set, work once and crochet first. Place a marker in the first stitch. Next, work one decrease, which is to combine two stitches into one stitch. Once on crochet and one decrease are finished, one set is done. Keep working for more sets. Work once on crochet and one decrease as one set. Five sets are done. Break yarn, leaving a long yarn tail. Pull the yarn tail out. Remove the marker. We can cut off this yarn tail or hide it inside the fabric. Thread this yarn tail through the needle. Flatten the foot and sew up its top size in this way. One foot is completed. Please crochet three more feet in the same way by yourself. You should use the corresponding yarn in the kit according to the instruction.